Hello everyone, welcome to my second CVS haul video for this week of deals valid through April the 17th. So CVS has been on fire this week. I posted a live clearance haul video where I grabbed some clearance that you're gonna see here in this video. And I will have clearance picks with tags at the end of the video. So definitely check out your store. Clearance can vary per store, so keep that in mind as you are shopping, but definitely scan your items in store to see if you can grab some goodies. So I did do the Boost deal, and you can tell, Boost is very hard to find in store. Um, Sunday, I had to get a rain check, and then I went to a different store and was able to find some Boost products, but I had to kind of mix and match my deal a little bit and switch it up. Um, and I did do the spend 40, earn a $10 extra buck deal that I'm gonna share with you in just a moment. And I did pick up some Oral-B toothbrushes and more in this video, so stay tuned. So thanks to you guys for mentioning this deal again. Now, if you checked my Sunday post on Instagram, I did score some of these Kleenex Mega Jumbo Rolls in store. Um, and then for my second haul, there is the um, barcode there. Then in my second haul, when I went live, you guys had mentioned, um, or when I went live with the clearance haul, to ask the managers to see if there were some in back, and you guys were amazing. Ask your managers to see if they have any any additional ones in back, um, because they did. And I didn't get many, because there were some other couponers there, so I definitely enjoyed sharing this fine with them. But in our area, these are ringing up just 14 cents. They're regularly a dollar and 49 cents each. So a great addition to any stockpile. So first I'm gonna go into the boost deal. They're buy one, get one 50%. Buy four, get an $8 extra back this week. So a couple of tips if you're doing later in the week shopping and you haven't gone to store yet, you'll probably notice that boost drinks are pretty much thinned out. Um, your best bet when you're doing your deals, especially when you're grabbing these higher priced ones that are priced at $10.99, grab them in twos because that way what CVS will do is they take these two together and one will be full price, one will be 50%. So you can grab better savings that way. Now, it didn't. It worked out for these, and you'll see on my receipt that one was full price, one was 50%, but they didn't have two of these, two of the same. So I had to get what I could get. Now, let me tell you, I went Sunday, and my Sunday store had zero boost originals. So they did issue me a rain check. If your store is issuing rain checks, take advantage of those. You can use them for future weeks in your, in your couponing journey. The coupon for Boost 4 off 2 is printable and the insert coupon is good till June. So the easiest way to see how the deal worked out is to check out my receipt. You can see um, actually the drinks were $10.49, not $10.99. And that is on the high protein here. So you can see one of them ring up full price, one of them ring up 50% at $5.25. So try and get two of the same if you can because then it will knock off the 50%. It's still gonna give you 50% on the other one. So it took the higher priced that I paid full price, the $9.49 on the four pack of Max, and then I got 50% on the six pack of the peach drinks. So manufacturer coupons I used. I tried to use two insert coupons, but I had my digital sent to card and it would not take off one of the insert coupons. So the first coupon is the four off two insert. The second is the four off two digital. I used the five off 25 diet nutrition protein drink CRT. And then I had two of those $2 off boost CRTs. I had one from last week and one from this week. So I used a total of $7 in extra bucks and I paid $6.46 pre-tax. So that's a total of $13.46 out of pocket. Um, I did earn the $8 extra buck, which it wasn't printing the $8 extra buck, but then finally I got a good print of it. The machine was really slow when I was couponing. So that's $8 back, making these $5.46 for all four, or just $1.36 each. All right, so this is the next deal. I used a 10 off of 50 printed coupon on my receipt. Now, the crazy thing is, is I cannot find my receipt anywhere, but I'm going to show you the $10 extra buck that I did grab for the deal. Um, I had to throw in a filler item because using that 10 off 50 with the products that I grabbed here, I was 
under a dollar short, so I went to the dollar section and just grabbed this four pack of travel bottles for a dollar. So I think that was awesome, um, an awesome find anyway. Hopefully we can go somewhere and use those. But let me go through the um, deals that I did. So I've got the spend 40, earn a $10 extra back deal right here that I did. A lot of you guys gave me some awesome suggestions, so thank you to those who did. Then I did the L'Oreal L Vive deal. And then I just threw that in. So we're going to start with the spend 40, get a $10 extra buck deal. Um, I grabbed two of the head and shoulders, two for $12. Now we have a coupon for four off of two. It did include the dry spray. Be careful. My store had a lot of different sprays, but they didn't say dry spray. So I grabbed the dry spray. They're buy one, get one 50%. So they're $8.29 each. One's gonna be full price, one's gonna be 50%. And then there's a four off of two digital coupon. Next, I added in one of the Tide Pods at $4.94. There's a $2 digital coupon that I use. And then I did the secret aluminum free deodorant. This is $7.99 at my store. Buy one, get one 50%. So one was $7.99, one was $3.99. And then I use the $5.99 off two digital coupon. So before I go further, I know there's a lot of questions about, there's a ton of expired coupons that you could use in this scenario, but I did do some research on expired coupons at CVS and this is what I found. So I just wanted to bring this to your attention. I did pull up the CVS coupon policy and if you check the second bullet point, it states the coupons are void if copied scan, altered, or expired. So this is kind of an issue at CVS because technically I think that the cashiers do not have honestly the time to be checking each of the coupons when there's usually just one cashier at checkout. So it makes it really difficult for them to do that, especially when there are so many um, customers in line that they rely on the system to be updated. And I think that's another issue with CVS is that their um, coupon, um, you know, as far as being updated as expired in the system, it's not completely updated on time when coupons are expired versus when you go to Walgreens. If a coupon is expired, it will not be accepted at Walgreens. So I just wanted to bring this to your attention and I will drop in the description box below um, a copy of the coupon policy, the link to go ahead and check it out. And definitely this is just to share information um, I'm just letting um, you guys know and for me to know what the coupon policy does indeed state. So if you have any comments or feelings, the comments are there for you to go ahead and share. So I hope that was helpful. It's just information to share. Again, my job is not to, um, you know, say what everyone should do. Just it's rather putting the information out there for everyone to have. So here we go, spend 40, get 10. Now, the total in products here, and for my spend 40, um, get 10, remember, I used the 10 off of 50, so I had to use this filler item, but we'll get to that in just a second. Um, everything here totaled $41.35. This is without the 10 off 50. This is what you would pay, and this is why I wouldn't probably do the deal. But um, again, I used for my scenario, the three off two on the head and shoulders. That's a digital coupon, the $2 digital for the Tide, the $5.99 digital for the Secret, and the four off two digital for the Old Spice. So that brought my total down to $26.36 and you get a $10 extra buck. It would have been $16.36 for these seven products, which I think is overpriced as a couponer. I wouldn't have done this deal, but since I included the 10 off 50, it ended up making them $6.36 for all seven items or 90 cents each, which is a win definitely for couponing. So I think if you're doing the 10 off 40, if you have any type of, um, purchase-based coupon that you can use with your deal, definitely slam it in. Next, I did the L Vive deal. Now remember, I had to spend 50, so this was only 41.35. I had to add in these other items to use that $50, um, 10 off 50. So I did the L'Oreal deal really easy this week, two for $8. If you go into your 411 save insert, we have a four off two coupon. It'll bring it down to $4 for both, and then you will earn a $2 extra buck. So ends up being $2 for both or just a dollar each. And again, I added in these travel bottles. I was 
Let me see, what was my total? I was literally like a few cents short of 50. I was at 49.35 pre-tax. So I added this in to get to 50.35 in order to use that 10 off 50. In my clearance haul live video, I did mention that Oral-B toothbrushes and the Crest toothpaste select products are on sale for $2.99. Buy two, earn the $3 extra buck. So a big heads up. There are the twin packs that are being included in this promotion that are $9.49. So if you're just a digital shopper, we have that three off two digital. If your store has them, my stores were wiped out. So I just did the single toothpaste deal. Check online at cvs.com. I'll post a link in the description box below so you can check and see if they did become available online again. When I checked on Tuesday, they were currently out of stock. So just keep kind of checking. I usually check on Wednesdays and Saturdays. Those seem to be good restock days. But $2.99 for these, it was $5.98 for both. I used the three off two digital, which ended up making them $2.98 and got a $3 extra back. So those ended up being completely free. So stay tuned because at the end of the video, I'm going to have clips of the actual store tags for the clearance items that I purchased, but I wanted to just remind you of one great clearance find. It is on these Cliff Bar, the coffee collection. So my store had several of them and there's an awesome deal. So these are on clearance, as you can see per the tag, for just 42 cents. If you go into your Ibotta app, I have a 50 cent Ibotta rebate that I can do five times. So you can snag five of these, get 50 cents back on each, making them free and a money maker. Now, um, there's also a 10 cent protein bar rebate as well, so redeem for that. But I wanted to share that because that is an awesome deal. You can get these for free, five of them, and a money maker as well. Now I want to thank you guys for watching this video. If you have any awesome clearance finds and you want to share them with our coupon community, definitely tag me on Instagram so that I can share your coupon excitement with others. I think a lot of people are becoming frustrated and completely understand why with CRT issues or coupons not coming off at checkout, but we have to stay together and keep each other motivated because that is part of the coupon journey. There's always, you know, highs and there's lows and we all experience them and it's good to know that we're all here for each other. So definitely tag me on Instagram so I can share whether it's your stockpile, whether it's an awesome find, whether it's a way you're giving back to the community. I would love to share them. So I want to thank you guys for watching. If you found some awesome clearance find, post them in the description box below in the comments. Definitely take advantage of the comments. They're there to help share deals and to help us all save.